Hey guys, how's it going? Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix this problem with your 3D prints not sticking to your print bed. This can happen for a few different reasons and I'm going to show you how to fix all of them in this video. So, let's get started. Alright, so the first issue that can cause your prints not to be sticking to your print bed is the Z offset. And what this is, is how close the nozzle is to your print bed. And if it's not at just the correct distance, it will not print correctly and the prints will not stick or they will get all messed up and pushed off the print bed. So to fix this, we are going to level our machine and we are going to fix the Z offset. So on my machine in Ender 3 V3 SE, what I'm going to do is level the machine and this also takes care of the Z offset. So for whatever your machine you have, you are going to level it and reset the Z offset. This will fix many issues with your prints and also help it stick to the print bed. The next thing that's causing our prints not to stick to our printer bed is our printer bed being dirty. So how we can fix this is just taking our printer bed off, taking it to a sink, grabbing a sponge and some um, Dawn dish soap preferably and using that with some hot water and just scrubbing all of those cr little crumbs and pieces of plastic off of our print bed and get it nice and clean like the first time we ever used it. And this will help our prints stick much, much better alone. All right, the next thing we can do to fix our 3D prints not sticking to our print bed is apply some sort of glue. So in my opinion, the best kind of glue you can use for this is the plain old purple stick um, glue that you can get. Elmer's preferably, but the knockoff brands work too. And you can just use this and apply it all over your print bed before you start your print. And this glue works perfect because when it's cold, um, it does not um, harden up. But when it gets hot, um, when the print bed heats up and the plastic goes on, it heats up and the, the glue dries with the plastic and it keeps it um, nice and secure on the print bed. So this is just to show you guys that this does indeed work. Here is the same print that just failed in the intro and I laid down a thick layer of purple stick glue and the print printed completely fine. So this is just to show you that the plain stick glue from the dollar store or Walmart, Elmer's brand or whatever does indeed work for your 3D printer. Probably just as well as any printer glue that you'd get on Amazon or anything. If we don't have any stick glue um, and we don't want to run to the store and get any, we can use hairspray for the same exact purpose. We can just spray it over the print bed and this will help our prints stick to our bed much, much better. So again, you can just grab some hairspray, spray it over your bed and this will work too. Just to show you again, here is another print that I printed right after I used that glue with some hairspray instead of glue um, and it worked just fine. So just to show you guys that this hairspray does indeed work as a um, agent to get the plastic to stick to the print bed. Okay, the last thing we can do to improve our 3D prints sticking to our print bed is actually in the slicer for the 3D file itself. So we're going to head over to our slicer, whatever slicer we use, but we want to go over to our bottom surface pattern. So for me, it's in our strength category over here and then our bottom surface pattern. And we're going to want to give it this pattern right here opposed to this one because this one just goes in straight lines. And whenever I have printed with this pattern, I have noticed that it hasn't stuck to the bed as good as this pattern is that just goes in circles. So I would um, choose an Archimed pattern compared to a monotonic pattern for sure. This has given me much better results in printing my files, especially little characters like this. 
So to improve your prints sticking to your 3D printer bed, you can do all of these things. And you should start with leveling your machine and resetting your Z offset. After that, you should grab a sponge and some dish soap and wash off your printer bed real good. If the prints still aren't sticking, I would try some Elmer's glue or some hairspray. And if the, if the prints still are not working, then maybe it is your slicer and I would try slicing your bottom layer with a different pattern and see if that works better like the pattern that I recommended you. So that's it for this video guys. Hope you enjoyed. Just wanted to make a quick video to hopefully help some of you guys out there get your 3D prints to stick to your 3D printer bed. And I usually like to make these videos less than five, six minutes so that you can get in, get in the information you need and get out. So a like or subscription would greatly be appreciated. So again, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.